Hello everyone. In this video, I will explain how to use the loop and group commands in SAP ABAP. I will show you three different ways of grouping data. In one example, I use two parameters, group size and group index to determine the number of different groups and their frequency. Okay. Uh, for my example today, I need an internal table filled with data. And for this, I write uh, select into table at data it sb fly from sb fly. Next, uh, I write the loop and the grouping example. I loop over the internal table and for this I write loop at it sb fly designing field symbol c. Group by c care ID ascending. Next, I close the loop. And with this command, we do the loop and we group the entries over the column carity. And uh, let's display the data. Write C care ID and C con ID. Uh, let's check pretty print and activate the code. And let's run the code. And we see here the grouped data from my table. And the information of the column column con ID. For example, we can compare the group data with the data in the table. Okay. So, and if I want to go the single records as well, I have to assign the field symbol to another field symbol. So I write loop at group C assigning field symbol P. So that means that the group of my grouped data will be assigned to the other field symbol P. And I show you this here. I write here the, the data of the assigned field symbol. For example, care ID, con ID. And I write uh, two columns, city from and and I close the loop here. And for a better understanding, I write here a new line and let's activate the code and run it. And we see here the, the header line, for example, the, the carrier A set. This carrier has two uh, entries in the table. The same with the other carriers.
Okay. Another another option is uh, to to read the the number of groups and to and to get the number of entries of the different groups and for this we need another another call i copy the first lines the first lines here of my loop and there is a different group command first i close the loop and then i set the new grouping i need first uh, the care id my care id is c care id And then I use the two parameters first for the size is group size and second the index is group index. Then I close the bracket and I sort it descending. And I write here the string without members. So I get only the size and the index and the care ID, the grouped care ID. And then I have to write reference into data. And the name of my object here is O care ID. Okay, so that means we loop over the internal table and we uh, get some information about the grouped data, for example, the size and the number and then the, the index number, the group index. So I write it. Oh, care ID. And I have three values here. First, the care ID, second, the size, and third, the index. And last, the uh, index, it's O care ID index. So let's activate the code and run. And we see here the grouped information about the table and the number of the records of this carrier in my table. So I show the table again. We see here two records with a set of the carrier and the third column is the number of the different carriers in my table. In this case, we have six different carriers. Okay, so let's go back. And if I want to show the, the members of the grouping of the grouped information, I have to assign this object to another field symbol as well. And for this, I write loop at group o care id assigning field symbol p. I close the loop 
and I can write my data here with the field symbol P and then the columns. First, care ID. Second, the con ID. And the last two columns, city from and city to. So pretty print and activate the code. Let's run the code. And we see here the header. It's the, the grouped header. It's the carrier. The number of entries. And the entries itself. For example, LH for Lufthansa for entries. Okay. Okay. That was it already. I hope you liked the video. If that is the case, I would appreciate the thumbs up. You can also leave me a comment. I would be happy if you subscribe to my channel and I hope to see you again in one of my next videos. Thank you and see you soon.